Hey guys, welcome back. Today's kind of a special day on the channel. It's my first subscription box, and this one is from Grand Slam Card Club. Got a really nice box here. There you see their website. I've opened this box. I haven't opened the cards in it, but I've just kind of peeked inside to see what we got going on so I wouldn't be completely uh, not prepared. I wanted to be as prepared as I could be. So it looks like we've got a lot of good stuff in here. So we'll go ahead and get started. So there's a little bit of information here. I'll share that with you guys. So the website is, uh, you see a little bit of information about it. Tells you about the January box. And then there's the website, Grand Slam Card Comp or GrandSlamCardClub.com with Facebook and Instagram. So And then uh, he does do the, right now he's got uh, football and, well this is what's coming in 2021. Right now he's got football and baseball, and this is a baseball box. So thank you, James, for inviting me to do this. Really, this is going to be very exciting for me as I've not done any of these subscription boxes before. So we're going to start with a, we have a numbered card in there of, and I'm going to try to read this, Roy Oswalt, numbered, what does that say, 80 out of 149. I know this is upper deck. I want to say it's about 2008. Well, he nailed that one. So 2008, very nice parallel there. Then we also had a relic here. Very nice, Elvis Andrews from Heritage. What year is this? I'm going to have to look at this off camera because I'm getting too bad of a glare. I can't even see it off camera. 2020 Tops. 2020 Tops Heritage. So very nice. Appreciate those. Get those sleeved up here shortly. Then our packs, we have a 2020 Prism, we have a 20 or a 20, 1988 Don Russ, 2020 Tops Update, 2014 Bowman Draft, 2018 Gypsy Queen, and 2020 Allen and Ginter. So I'm looking forward to going through these. I'm going to save those little uh, styrofoam pieces. I like to use those foam bits myself when I pack up some packages. So we'll get these all spread out here. I think we're going to start with the 88 Donruss and just work our way forward chronologically. So 88 Donruss. No, there's a few good rookies in there. I know Tom Glavin's in there, Roberto Alomar, to name a few. Of course, it does have the puzzle piece, which Donruss is famous for. Who did we have on the puzzle? Who was our puzzle that year? Stan Musial. Stan Musial. So, Carney Lansford. Of course, these are all going to bring back some memories for me but during my early collecting days. Ron Guidry, Ellis Burks, Lou Whitaker. Familiar with all those. Hall of Famer. Very nice. Cal Ripken Jr. there. Benito Santiago. Scott Sanderson. Ooh, we got the Tom Glavin rookie. Very nice. So we did get a nice Glavin rookie. We've got a Hall of Famer, Cal Ripken Jr. Some other nice cards in there, so we'll have to get those sleeved up. So we'll go up next is 2014 Bowman Draft. Not sure who's going to be in this set, as this is the first pack of this that I've ever opened. Let's look at the back of the pack, see what the, the odds are for what we can pull. Looks like there's a lot of different inserts and parallels that we could pull. So we're going to start off with Mark Apple or Mark Appel. So a lot of these names I'm going to be very unfamiliar with. Tyler Kolek, first Bowman card there. Jacob Gatewood. I have to take my glasses. Oh, wow. We got a hit right out of the box. Mike Pappy. Mike Pappy. Let's see if that might be numbered on the back. It is not numbered, but we did get a hit, so that's very awesome. Jordan Luplo, Clayton Blackburn, and Jackson Reitz. You guys will probably know more about those names than I do, but still very cool to get a hit in our just our second pack. So, chronologically, 2018 is going to be our next year. This pack feels a little thick, but it could be a decoy card in there. 
Got Mike Trout on the front there. Very nice. Let's look at the back of it. See what we got going on there. There's your odds in case you guys want to see those. Pops puts odds to me. He puts print runs. We've determined that here <laughs> very quickly. But it took us a long time to determine that it wasn't odds but print run. So we're going to start off with a very nice Aaron Judge. I always like these cards that look like throwback versions. So like Gypsy Queen and then Allen and Ginter. Really like those. Dansby Swanson. Oh, and we got another hit. Zach Granite. It's a rookie card. So we're going to... Let's flip that over and see what we got going on. Very nice. 2018 Gypsy Queen. And then, then the Zach Granite base card. That's pretty cool. Right back to back. Andrew Stevenson and John Lester of the Cubs. So got some nice cards there. And we'll just go ahead and go with 2020 Allen and Ginter. I've always enjoyed the Allen and Ginter sets. Again, I love these cards that have that nostalgic look to them. Some people feel that Allen and Ginter's a little gimmicky, and yeah, I'll agree that there are a few cards in there that get a little bit off base, but there's also some really, really nice things in there that you can pull. So we're going to start off with Aaron Judge. So we're starting off with Aaron Judge an awful lot today, but I'll take it. I will take it for sure. Larry Doby, I believe he was the first black player for the Cleveland Indians. We have um, that Thais. I probably burnt that name up. Matt Thais. Mercado. Oscar Mercado. Mercado. We have Cron. C.J. Cron, Tim Lincecum. Then we have a mini of Albert Pujols. Very cool. And then a debut to remember, Stephen Matz. Very cool. Got some really nice stuff in that one. So then we have Prism and Topps 2020 update. Both 2020s. So let's go with the Topps update. <clears throat> Getting a little bit ahead of myself here. Need to peel this down. Because I'm sure you guys might want to look at the odds. Try to get that in focus as best as I can for you. Looking forward to some of the other releases that they're going to do at Grand Slam Card Club. Very excited to see what's coming up in the future. So we have Yoan Lopez. Aaron Judge, again, so any path that Aaron Judge has been eligible to be found in, we've seen to found him. I'm not going to complain about that. Cal Ripken Jr., very nice. This is a really nice pack. Kyle Wright. We'll go back to another Aaron Judge. That's awesome. Let's keep the Aaron Judges coming. I'm sure we got some viewers out there that really like Aaron Judge. Pete Alonzo, not going to complain there. Is that... Neil Walker, um, my eyes were out of focus, not the camera. Craig Kimball. Players are decades best. Randy Johnson. Of course, very, very uh, dominant pitcher. Then Julio Turan. Probably just butchered that, but we're good. You guys know who it is. Drew Pomeranz. Giancarlo Stanton. And Chris Davinsky. So definitely got some nice cards in that pack. We are down to our last pack, 2020 Prism. So, so far, I'm happy with what we got so far. Hope you guys have enjoyed these packs. Holy smokes, that's a lot of, uh, a lot of opportunity there. A little more, a little more difficulty opening this one. So we start off with Nico Horner, James Paxton, see a nice blue card coming up here, Kirby Yates, really nice parallel, and it is numbered 103 out of 199, very nice. You know, we like the numbered cards here, 
Jordan Alvarez, and we conclude with Francisco Lindor. So these have been some really, really nice packs. So once again, we did get the Tom Glavin rookie. We got a nice uh, relic there of Elvis Andrews. And then, of course, I got to tilt this so I can read it. Roy Oswalt, that 2008 Upper Deck Parallel. And then if you've seen us, we did pull a couple of autographs. And I'll get those sleeved here in just a moment. I just wanted to have everything in one uniform stack. But our first two stack, or first two packs, we did, or two of the first three packs anyway, pulled a couple of nice autographs. We'll get those sleeved up here just as soon as we conclude the video. But I want to give you guys an opportunity to see those a little bit more up close. But once again, I'll put all this in the description as well so you guys can go, go check it out. But it's GrandSlamCardClub.com. Um, the pro there's a promo code. If you enter high octane one, that's the number one, high octane one, you'll get 5% off of your order on grandslamcardclub.com. So go check them out. I think you'll really like what you'll see there. There's several different tiers and several different packages. You're not committed to just one particular, um, style. So that's what I like. I chose what I wanted to start with, and I might go up, I might go down, I might just jump all around on all these packages to see what they have to offer. You can choose to do one month, or you can just choose to continue to the monthly subscription, which is what I have done. I'm going to have a monthly um, rip on here every month from them. So once again, thank you, James, for reaching out to me. I do appreciate that. Um, I will have all the information that you guys need in the description. Once again, GrandSlamCardClub.com. Go check them out. Promo code HIGHOCTANE1. That's the number one. HIGHOCTANE1. You will get 5% off your purchase. So once again, thanks to James. Thanks to the viewers for making this happen. I really do appreciate it. Thanks to the likes, the subs, the comments. We want to keep it rolling. Let me know what your favorite card was in this rip because there's a lot to choose from. So we will see you again tomorrow. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday.